called Seeing the Light by Cynthia de Est. A light that scatters stretches across the sea from the shore beneath me to the afternoon sun. The bright, ultraviolet jocks dance like nothing I have ever seen. They last, sting my mind like synapses meeting outside the sphere. But I reflect too long at the path to receive. It scores my eyes, leaves a yellow swath everywhere I look, and recedes on a trace of lavender. The path was there and disappeared like that. And uh, then, uh, my poetry is in North Carolina, where we, we make uh, our home most of the year. But I, I'm like Heidi, I, I, I started writing some things when this first happened. And some of mine, uh, it's very personal. I feel like the uh, poet I knew once was Port Moret of North Carolina, and she said, I feel like it's a sin to share my poetry. <laughs> but she ended up doing so. But um, some of it is very personal. But this one, I was feeling very dark when I saw the first internet pictures come up out of Louisiana. And that's what inspired this darkness, demons of darkness. Darkness covers the face of the deep flows into the light of day and sweeps the sun away to some forbidden world. The more I anoint with religious rites, it fights me off and buries deeper still, hoping I'll forget it's even there. Through day, through night, I wrestle with its tight grip on all humanity as the sea gives up, up its dead. And yet, I will not bow my head and surrender to the demons of darkness.